My name is Nima Sarli. I'm a PhD student in Mechanical Engineering Department. Um, I'm also a member of Advanced Robotics and Mechanisms Applications Laboratory, or ARMALAB. One of the projects that I've been working on ever since I joined ARMALAB is on a snake-like device for bladder cancer diagnosis and treatment. So it's a flexible device that can be deployed through the urethra inside the bladder. It has three working channels for deployment of uh, surgical graspers, which are used for grasping tissues, tiny camera, and other instruments. Currently, most bladder cancer cases are uh, diagnosed and treated with a procedure called transurethral resection of bladder tumors. So in this procedure, the surgeon uses a tool, it's called resectoscope, and she looks through the, uh, the scope, and once she finds the tumors, uh, she starts resecting them by scooping them out using this uh, loop at the tip. So what happens is, in a, in a lot of cases, um, the patients have to go through multiple procedures um, because the urologist cannot remove the entire uh, tumors from the bladder. And this makes bladder cancer treatment uh, very expensive. Also, it is challenging for the urologist to be able to realize how far she has penetrated into the tissue of the bladder wall. Um, and this increases the chances of complications uh, during the operation, like uh, piercing the bladder wall. So these things motivated us in designing a robotic device that we call Turbot. So it has a snake-like device at the uh, distal end, which provides even more dexterity than the human hands. And the surgeon can steer this robot with this haptic device. It's essentially an uh, advanced uh, joystick. So using this robot, the surgeon can reach the entire uh, urinary bladder and can perform uh, resections that are more accurate than manual resections in a safer way. Ultimately, um, this robot can potentially improve the patient outcomes and reduce the surgical costs um, by providing the surgeon with a safer, smarter, and more capable device.